Today we are going over everything new at Target for the holiday season. It's officially November and they have pretty much all their Christmas stuff out. I am going to be going over Christmas decor. We're going to go over the Bullseye's Playground section, see what's new there, some clothing, candles, and they had so much new body care that I am so excited about. It's going to be a long one, so let's get into it. All right, let's start with what they have here in the Bullseye's Playground section. They're definitely putting some cute stuff out. Look at these little ornaments. The gumball machine is adorable. They have some different sequin trees and little holiday ornaments. This is cute. I love this chrome tree. Let's see, you could, I think this one lights up actually. I'm not sure if it has batteries in it already, but that's pretty. They have these different colored little village houses down here that also light up. And this one's really pretty too with this like confetti sparkle. That one also lights up too. Let's see, these are mostly all like, these are $5, these little houses are three. Here's some super cute stuff over here. These are all measuring cups. How adorable. I love the gingerbread one. I feel like that's reasonable for only $5. So cute. These little candles. We have Fested Fur and also Cypress and Champagne. And these are $3. We also have these little plates that you could put out different cookies for the holiday season. These are $3. Some festive rolling pins here. This little Santa tray that you could put your cookies and milk on. And these are so cute. These are $5 and they're little measuring spoons. I feel like these are gonna go so fast. They match with the measuring cups. So they have the Christmas tree, the gingerbread, and the little snowman guy. Those are probably like two of my favorite things they have. These little mini baking sets too. It's a very small bowl, so you won't get much cookie dough out of it, but it does come with a little cookie cutter and everything, which is pretty cute. It is just plastic, though. These are for $5. There's some more cute stuff in here. Is this a little penguin? I think that's a penguin. Some more candles, dish towels. They always have fun ones down here. I've seen people really excited about this bow thing. It's a candle holder that is in the shape of like a bow or stars. They also have these really cute gingerbread houses here, but I can't find them at my store, so they must have went pretty quick or they haven't put them out yet. Here's some mugs. This is a cute little gingerbread one with a candy cane holder. They have some Santa ones. There's a pink Santa. I love these candy cane trays. That would be cute as a little riser to decorate with. They also have it in green with little candy cane, um, or they kind of look like elf feet a little bit. Oh, these are fun. There's a gingerbread house, little cookie jar, and a peppermint candy one. And then they have this cute candy cane jar too. I think this is a Christmas tree jar as well. And then they have like a little pink jingle bell too. So it looks like they're just starting to get some fun stuff in. Oh, these are cute. These are $3 glass cups with the peppermint on the bottom that would be a cute little set and then they have a cup of christmas cheer here too there is some candy cane ribbon trees oh this doormat is cute for five dollars it looks like a little christmas candy cane present a little wreath i just ugh, i love checking out what they have in this section because it's always just the cutest stuff and it's all under 10 bucks so sometimes you can find some real good hidden gems there's some fun socks as well and some like little pillows too like gingerbread christmas tree there's a gingerbread house and i think what is this a little reindeer so that's kind of an overview of what they have so far at store number one all right let's check out some of the christmas decor my store has out already we have the hearth and hand magnolia section they have some really pretty wreaths up front and some huge stockings too you know I'm a sucker for their candles. I can't remember which ones we already had for fall, but they have the Cypress and Santa. Ooh, that's pretty. They definitely, I feel like, went more sensual with their scents. This is Balsam and Berry. I love these candles. They always have all different sizes. This size in particular is about $12.99. They have these little baby ones too, 
which I feel like when you get done with this, you can maybe use this as like a cookie cutter. And then mold spice. Ooh, that is yummy. And fireside spruce. More festive items from the Threshold brand, which they always have really good candle designs. This is pretty. The gold kind of stands out. This is forest fir from them. That's like classic Christmas tree scent with a little bit of like spice in it. And then holiday hearth. Ooh, that's really fruity. I don't know if it has the notes on these, but they have all sorts of different packagings for those. Is this a candle? It's a scented ornament. Wait, that would be such a good idea to put a few of those on your tree. I wonder how long that would last. That's really cool. This, I think, is a candle. The top comes off. Oh yeah, that's the forest for two, and you get a decorative little tree for 20, and they have this big 22 ounce as well. And then they have Holiday Hearth in the gold tree. And then they do have some little sets too that could be for gifting for $20 for both of the scents. So it must be they're doing two major scents this Christmas, just classic Christmas scents. These are gorgeous. I really like these cups with the bows on them. Those are $3. And they have a nice Christmas tree one. The gold rim is super pretty. They do have some matching little appetizer plates too with the bow. This is the matching tree one, and they also have a little merry one too, and these are $3. And then I love seeing what they have for different holiday mugs. That's cute little reindeer. These are all $5. They have a penguin, a bunch of different actually penguin options. They have different sizes too, like there's the big gingerbread and the small one. I love this gingerbread house one as well. That might, might be my favorite so far. They also have like a Santa, there's a Nutcracker. These are cute too. It says, look inside for a surprise. Oh, there's a little peppermint in there. It's cute. Little Christmas Village with the snowflake. This one's really pretty too, the warm and cozy. And I do really like this like merry and bright Christmas tree one. There's a little Christmas tree in there. That is adorable. But yeah, they have a ton of different mugs out now. Lots of cute designs. Let me know which one's your fave. So the Auden or Auden brand has this really cute kind of cozy collection here. It's a lot of like just really soft fabrics, a lot of cute like PJ lounge things. Like these tees are so soft and they all say different things on them. Cute. It looks like they had matching shorts as well, but I'm sure this collection has been going pretty quick. There's like some silk sets, the bralettes. I really do like their bralettes cozy little sweater. They had some candles to match and like reed diffusers. And then these kind of remind me of like the fuzzy skins. These look like cute little holiday bags too. Look at the little bow on that one. That's adorable. And they have this red one too. Some fun kind of holiday dresses. This bow one is pretty. I'm seeing a lot of velvet this year. This is the velvet jumpsuit. Okay, this is kind of fun, but they have this bodysuit that has a huge bow in front, so it looks like a Christmas present. That's actually so cute. That's 20, they have it in the red. I'm wondering how that would look on, I don't know. They also have it in black. These are cute little sweaters from A New Day, little cardigans. I love this pink. That's pretty. They have a lot of fun new boots in too. I really like these. And lots of sparkly ones. Cute. Lots of really pretty heels as well. And these have memory foam in them, but they have a gorgeous big bow on the toe. They have it in red too. And like these kitten heels are so popular right now. I just, I'm not a fan of the kitten heel. This one's kind of like a sheer mesh fabric. And then they have these jeweled ones too. These are actually really pretty. They're kind of, I feel like they'd be uncomfortable though because that's like plasticky on the inside. Ooh, these are gorgeous. I like these a lot. I feel like these are like sold out. I don't even see them, but those are stunning. And they have a bigger heel on them. I love how sparkly they are though. These are gorgeous too. I 
feel like they always kind of do something similar each year, but like jazz it up a little bit for the current trends. These look really nice in the all in motion section. They have this everyday soft cord collection with leggings and the bras. These are so soft. They honestly kind of feel like Lululemon quality. In the leggings too, they do feel a lot like the Lululemon. I'm very curious about these. Usually I need like a 7 8 length though, so I don't know if they would work. It seems like a lot of them are sold out too, but they feel really nice. I'll have to see if I can find them online. These are so cozy from the Outen brand too. They got rid of one of my favorite brands here, the Stars Above, so I don't think they sell it anymore, but I feel like Outen's kind of taking over, but these are so soft, these cozy joggers. I might have to grab a pair. They have it in the red too. I don't know if they'd be too long, but they're super, super soft. Usually the joggers are nice because I can just kind of roll them up. I like the gray as well. It looks like they have matching um, little sleep shirts too. Here's some sets that they have. But yeah, I think Outen did completely take over and they got rid of Stars Above, unfortunately. Okay, we're gonna try and film these, but there's like a cart here, so I'm gonna try to squeeze in. But I've been looking for this new Dove collection. Um, they have a holiday treats line that's exclusive to Target with different scents, and they have one at Walmart with different scents. I did find the Walmart ones last week, but they're just starting to put these out. So I went and asked, and they went to go check the back to see if they have more body wash, but so far they have the soaps in the three new scents, and I did find one body wash in the gingerbread delight so you can only get this one at Target but Dove is so smart for doing this because they know we want the yummy gourmands but the gingerbread you can kind of smell them with the soap this one does seem really nice I have been buying so many gingerbread perfumes lately like this is gonna go nice with the Joe Malone gingerbread being Frenchy just came out with one that smells like gingerbread it's called moon milk so I will be picking this one up. This one smells so good, the Frosted Plumberry. Not usually one I would go for, but this is yummy. Like it smells like fruit delicious gummies and I need it in the body wash. These are all $7 and then I'm so excited they're bringing the Hot Cocoa Swirl in body wash as well. Now I don't know if these are coming in scrubs. Oh, they are coming in scrubs too, okay. So yeah, I know they had mini Hot Cocoa Scrub that smelled amazing. Right now, this kind of smells like very soapy and not as good as the scrub. The scrub is like pure chocolate goodness. So I'm like, I don't know if this is gonna be as good. We'll see. But yeah, they have three new scents coming. Looks like body wash scrub and the bar soap as well. So I'm very excited to at least pick this one up. Okay, I had to share these. Now they are just putting these out. These are the new EOS lotions. Um, they just had them on their cart. I nicely asked the lady if I could buy one and she said yes. So she got them out for me, but they're just putting them out now. I know some people are finding at least this one at Kohl's and there is another one with blue packaging that I do have at home because I ordered off Amazon like a month ago. But the sparkling amber, I've been hearing good things about. I think it's supposed to smell kind of like Sol de Janeiro, um, but Flora again. It has cotton candy, Cur Royale, and Ambroxan, and that Ambroxan note is the same thing that's in like Baccarat Rouge. So I feel like that's going to smell similar. And I feel like this one might be exclusive to Target, the Peppermint Cashmere. I have no idea if these are good, but I love this lotion formula. So, I mean, I'll take any scent in these. I'm excited. It has candy cane, marshmallow fluff, and sandalwood. The lady was so nice, and she just let me know that they had the new tree hut scrubs as well, so she grabbed those for me. But these officially come out November 3rd in all stores, but sometimes you can find them early if they don't mind. But I have to show you. Look what's coming back. Frosted sugar cookie. I know you guys are excited about this one. They had this one two years ago. I think they brought it back, and it is coming back again. And I don't think anyone's showed this yet, so I'm the first, I guess. And then also, she grabbed me the Enchanting Emerald scrub as well, which has Prosecco and Sandalwood. This sounds like it wouldn't be my favorite, but I'm gonna try it and see. But yeah, the sugar cookie one is really good. It's it's not like the most authentic sugar cookie, but it's nice and warm, like a light spice. So I'm very excited about these, and that lady was so nice to grab them. All right, I finally found a couple more sets in advent calendars here. 
So we do have the 12 Days of Beauty. I've encountered these are always really popular from Target. I'm thinking if I wanna get one and try it out, it does tell you everything you're gonna get inside. These are usually a pretty good deal. This does tell you everything you're gonna get inside, so if you don't wanna see, um, I, won't, I won't spoil it for you. But yeah, there is 12 really good products in here. It's a value of $70, and it's $20, and these are usually pretty good. And they also have the skincare one too which is going to have 12 awesome, probably deluxe size skincare products, sometimes full size too. But I did take a peek and I'm really excited about the beauty one actually. I'm like, hmm, should I get one and unbox it for my channel? I think that could be a fun video since I don't think many people have done it yet. And then they also have this cute Enchanting Eyes set, which is gonna have a bunch of different eye products, some of their best sellers, like the CoverGirl Clean Topia Mascara, which says it's a surprise color. Um, there's the Firework Mini Mascara, a Lash and Roll Full Size, some lashes, a lash curler, a brow lift, and it looks like, I think that's a eyeliner. And this is a $43 value for 20. They have a lip set as well, which which includes a NYX, well, two NYX Butter Gloss, one full-size clear, one mini pink one. There's a mini Well People, or that could be full-size, honestly, and then I'm not sure what the last one is. Oh, it's an Elf Glossy Lip Stain, and it's a full-size in Power Up Mauve, but it says Surprise, but, oh, it looks like you could get Pinkies Up or Power Mauve. They have a cute skincare set, too. This has a lot of different masks in it, but there's also some, like, Dr. Teal's bath stuff some body lotions, a lot of minis. This is the Ready for the Road Travel Essentials Kit. That's kind of nice, something to kind of keep as like a little road trip. Or if you have a friend that has a road trip coming up, this could be nice. It has all your essentials that you need, like a little comb, a lint roller, your wet wipes, all of that, band-aids. And then this is a little jet set kit. So again, it has all your essentials if you have a travel lover in your life, good gift. This has liquid IV, the pimple patches. I bring those with me all the time. A little sleeping mask. There's a mini toothpaste lotion. I feel like it needs a cleanser though. There is like um, a scrunchie too in here and some dry shampoo. So they have like the women's one and they do have this one too, which can be for men or anyone really because it has toothpaste, it has some protein coffee working hands hand cream and those are $20 as well so yeah these ones I haven't seen yet so that was exciting to find these kits but those advent calendars usually go pretty quickly okay just wanted one more thing I don't know if these are like have they had lotions like this before but they are getting the tree hut peppermint pearl in a moisturizing body lotion I don't know if that is a new formula but I did spy that in here as well and just some restocks, like here's the Twinkling Topaz Foaming Gel Wash. We did see that in one of the gift sets. All right, next Target has, I think, some more decor. Like they have a bunch of their ornaments in their regular like Wonder Shop line kind of set up. All their different Christmas trees over here and a few aisles of some decor. Oh my gosh, look how huge these are. Lots of cute sets. Here's what I'm looking for. Ooh, it's like they just put it out, but they have a bunch of different nutcrackers. These are like almost so lightweight, almost foam-like, but they have that in the gold, this fun like velvet green. I love the velvet pink, and they also have it in a sparkly. But yeah, these are super, super lightweight. There's a few more colors down there, and those are all $5. And then they have the same material in these like different deers with some different colors and also these also are that super lightweight where they're like little village houses and also these trees are really pretty. I don't know, those feel like really cheap though. These look a little more expensive down here. Yeah, that one's really heavy. Really pretty gold deer. Oh my word, I love this. Look at this, like it looks like a bubble wreath. It's chrome. That's gorgeous, that is $20. They have a joy to the world sign for five. And these beautiful trees as well. This is a really pretty light up Noel sign. Love that, that one's 25. And then this is another light up little house. Let's see, that one's not working. There we go. 
they did a lot of mushroom stuff for Halloween, but they also have some for fall, like this like woodland forest kind of vibe going on. This tree is kind of cute too. And then they have these little cottages and some little fuzzy deer down here, fuzzy trees, and just some little decor pieces. Also, those same kind of almost styrofoam felt lightweight nutcrackers also have these huge ones, which I feel like they did this at Walmart last year, something similar. And they also have a huge tree, and these are $25. A few more things down this aisle too. They actually put quite a bit of stuff out. These are cute little wreaths that you can kind of decorate how you want. And they have matching trees in these kind of almost muted pastels. Here's another little countdown to Christmas and they have this gorgeous like white and silver collection. Here's another fun wreath. A piece neon sign. So this is going to light up. Ooh, pretty. I like this uh, little cone tree as well. It's so gorgeous. Like that's going to sparkle so much. And they have these. And then just some plain silver and gold. They have a couple more signs where the treetops glisten. And then they also have a winter wonderland sign here. This is a really pretty chrome nutcracker. Lots of pretty stuff in this aisle. I was looking for this at the other store because the Elf did a collaboration with Stanley Cup, which is kind of cute. And I'm wondering if they sold out I think they did. They sold out of all of the lip oil holders, but basically they came out with a pretty basic Stanley. Like this one's kind of a light sparkle. I think it says, I don't know if it says elf on the actual Stanley. It just maybe says it on the wrapping. But then they had these cute little holders that you would attach to it and you'd put your lip oil in it. And I wanted one. <laughs> I should have bought one online because they were available yesterday, but yeah, these are selling out pretty quick. I think people just wanted the holder because yeah, they could have done a better job with the actual Stanley's to be honest. They just had that sparkly red, which is going fast. This is an iridescent burgundy. They have this like champagne sparkle too and then these are all, well, this one's not, but this one's an elf one. They had a matching lip oil holder and then this, but yeah. Ugh, I'm so mad that they're sold out of them all. I might check one more store. Let's see if there's any. Oh, wait. These are ornament keychains. Little <laughs> elf ornaments. These don't say elf on them, though. But these are just little Stanley look like keychains, but yeah. I really wanted that lip oil holder because I just thought that was a really fun touch. It's interesting because the second story I'm at, they have more Christmas decor, but they don't have any of the beauty holiday sets out. But I think I'm gonna check just one more store, but first we'll go look at the Bullseye's Playground over here. Oh yeah, they have a lot of stuff in here. These are little light up trees. They have more of these um, bottle brush ones. Some cozy socks, some more pillows. Oh, this is what I saw, and these are so freaking cute. I kind of want to get a couple. But they have this little gingerbread village. These are light up too, and they're only $5. I feel like that's a good deal. So they have this little candy store. There's also this little Coco Cafe. These are very glittery though, by the way. And then this is a little coffee store. Look at the gingerbread guy. These are the ones going viral. And they have a post office and this little house as well but yeah so much glitter oof oh my gosh they have a target store <laughs> they have a gingerbread target store are you kidding that is freaking cute okay i might get a couple of those i love doing gingerbread themed in my house and those are really affordable all right so last target i wanted to stop at i've been looking for these they have the new dr teal's holiday line i bought a vanilla one last year that was so good and i'm wondering if the sugar cookie is going to be similar because this sounds amazing but it was like the yummiest vanilla i have ever smelled and i love these for the bath and they also have a gingerbread one that's new too this one sounds amazing i mean i know i'm gonna use these so i think i'm gonna pick up both 
And if I love this one, I'm gonna have to remember to grab backups because I never saw the vanilla one come back. So <laughs> I'm gonna grab the sugar and I'm gonna grab the gingerbread one too and try these out. But these are so nice just to put in the bath. It helps your muscles if you have some aches and pains and they smell good too. Now this store also has singles of the Nature Well line that I was talking about earlier. So you can actually buy the mist separate. I don't know if it's something they're always gonna carry or maybe it's only certain locations. But yeah, this one is the 61 or 62 dupe. I have the green and then the mini creams to go with it. And also I really like these. I might grab another one. I bought one of these last year. It's just a silicone little scrubber and they're so much more hygienic than like a loofah. So they're antimicrobial exploiting. I just put my shower gel on this. I'm gonna pick up another one because I want one for my downstairs bathroom. And those are 10 bucks each. They also have here at Target in the makeup section, they did get the ColourPop Frosty the Snowman collection. I did do a full video on this one if you guys wanna check it out. It's such a cute one. You can kinda see the colors here. It's like really pretty icy cool tones. I did a really fun blue look with it and I think the palette is so fun. So yeah, you can get this at Target. I think Ulta and ColourPop, it's $24. There's glitter gels in the collection. A little Juicy Plumping Balm Trio, a lip liner and lipstick duo. They also have the lip mask and scrub, and of course the highlight set as well. They also just put out the new e.l.f. stuff as well, which is exciting because they have the new glitters. I did order a couple of these on e.l.f.'s website. They're only $6, and they're supposed to be super glittery and pretty, kind of similar to the Urban Decay Moon Dust shadows, but I think these have a little bit of a more fine glitter, so they have all the shades, but a lot of them, it looks like, did sell out already. This one looks so pretty. This one looks the most like Space Cowboy from Urban Decay. But yeah, I'll need to let you guys know how these are. It says they're getting the lip balm in two, but I do not see the lip balms quite yet. We also have another new makeup drop from CoverGirl, the Icy Shine Cooling Flumper here. There is some gorgeous shades in here, and it's supposed to be like their original Yummy Gloss, which is so popular. It's almost like a lip oil, lip gloss combo, but these have some shimmer and a plumper to them. So that's actually really exciting. I don't really see too many new makeup drops for the holidays. Usually it's after January like 2025, but there seems to be quite a bit right now. But yeah, you can kind of see they have a little shimmer to them. But these do look really fun. Look what is finally here. They have the Wicked Beloved Scents. I've been looking for these. So they have Body Mist and Defy Gravity and also So Popular. So there's one for Alphaba and Glinda. So So Popular. It says Juicy Red Berries and Feminine Notes of White Musk. And then Defy Gravity has Water Blossom and melon and crisp cucumber so cucumber melon maybe also there's body wash there's some candles so we can kind of smell them i don't think they have the glinda one though yeah this is definitely giving cucumber melon <laughs> i don't know maybe i was expecting more from these honestly i don't know if i'm gonna pick up any of these i was kind of excited but now i don't really like the scents as much <laughs> let me know if you guys find them if you try them what you think but yeah I try to only buy stuff that I like really love and these are just, I don't know, they're not it for me. Okay, more Christmas stuff. I actually heard a rumor this Target I'm at is like a test location. So I feel like sometimes they do put stuff out early and they do have even more <laughs> Christmas decor than the other ones did or they just put it out faster. They do have these like paper houses. Don't know how I feel about that. And for $5, that seems way overpriced for a little paper one. I mean, yeah, it's nice, it's not breakable, but I don't know how I feel about that. I don't think I like it. They do have some cute sequin stuff. The Joy, I bought a pink Joy sign like this, I think a few years back, and they have Noel, super pretty green. I feel like nothing is really catching my eye too much in this area. That star is really pretty. I do like this gold house too. And then all these bottle brush tree sets you can get. They did have a really big one over here. Look at these. That would be so fun to like even put on your porch or just, I kind of want one for my room. They're like 20 bucks, but they're huge. They're like almost the size of myself. Oh my gosh, look at these. These are 15, another big bottle brush tree. 
those are so pretty but i get so sad because they get all bent when i try to store them <laughs> but oh those are fun so I did buy quite a few things, especially for body care, but this video is already so long. I am going to be doing a separate like hygiene body care haul with some new arrivals that I picked up so we can talk about kind of what's worth it and what's not. But pretty much most of the things I did pick up, I initially liked the scent. Like I'm really excited about the new Dove collection. That's really good. The EOS Peppermint Cashmere Lotion is absolutely a must have. It is such a good peppermint vanilla that's not too much peppermint. I feel like a lot of other lotions kind of take the peppermint to an extreme it's like vanilla with a touch of peppermint and I really really like it I will be sharing that video with you guys soon but if you guys are wanting to shop these deals a lot of the stuff is online right now so I'll try to have it in YouTube shopping and in the description box for you but thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video bye guys